We're Freedom for the Animals New Zealand. We're here to bear witness to the chickens that are going in here. Teagle kill 9 million chickens a year. This is in Henderson, Aotearoa. We're six week old baby chickens and we're bearing witness before they're hidden away and slaughtered inside. These chicks are laying in their own feces for six weeks. See if you look in the gate, they spray down the air to try and keep the smell down of ammonia and blood. So yeah, it's pretty grim here. The trucks pull up and you can see and you can smell these animals. They're unaware of the suffering that they're going to experience. We're actually here protesting the fact that these animals are being abused inside that place there. Are they? Of course. Do you think that anything humane goes on in that place? No. Not at all, eh? No. Yeah, it's probably the complete opposite, isn't it? Yeah. What do you think about animal abuse? Oh, I'm against it. You're against it? Yeah. Do you think that sending these animals in the slaughterhouse would be counted as animal abuse? Uh, yeah. You might just put yourself in Yeah, imagine if you were one of those animals being sent in there. I wouldn't want to work there. No, I don't think anyone wants to work slaughtering animals, eh? No. Nah. Nah. We don't personally hate the people who are working here, but we hate what they're doing, you know what I mean? Because we want these guys to have different jobs, make different sources of food for people. But, you know, you know it's like a pink cow and all that, you know, you gotta, you gotta change that too. All the animals, yeah. everyone has to eat, but we don't have to eat animals to be happy or healthy, eh? Oh. Yeah. We don't, we don't need hey, what's wrong, what's wrong with Carol and Apple with that? <laughs> yeah, exactly, yeah, bro, exactly. Even if it was just one, if it was a dog, it would be viewed differently. And there's millions of them. But each one is an individual. It shouldn't be about whether they are intelligent by a human definition of intelligence. Rather, the fact that they can feel and they can suffer and they can experience pain. And that is the tragedy of this, and that it's happening, not for one, but for millions, trillions, all around the world. We don't have to be supporting this. We don't have to be paying for this cruelty. We can very easily switch to a plant-based diet, hopefully help transform the world so that there's less suffering and less cruelty. Innocent animals don't have to die because of our choices. And hopefully that happens sooner than later.